Hello and welcome to a new series of videos about plants. Not biological plants, systems, plant systems, processes, technical plants. Okay? We are going to talk about how to show, how to display what they are doing, how to visualize, how to plan those things and also taking into account uh, security, uh, safety. There we are going to get deep into the field of, of law. Uh, uh, deep. What is deep? Yeah? We are touching the field of law also and what things might get applicable to us as mechanical engineers yeah? or as engineers. So we're talking about plants, processes and so on. Let's first talk about what is a process. So, well, a process is something, a f some steps yeah, following each other yeah, and a process, there are several things interacting with each other one thing, there's another thing, there's a third thing, yeah? And those things, they will simply follow one after the other, yeah? Whatever is the in and output there and so on, yeah? So a process is the whole thing, is the whole thing, yeah? all parts which are dependent, which are dependent on each other and follow each other. Yeah? So the things which are running through a process, yeah? so this is the process. process. The things which go into the process, yeah, these are this material, raw material, something like this. Yeah. Things are need from a process. And then there's energy. And there is there are some agents which I need to fulfill my needs. Yeah? So these raw materials will be transferred with the help of energy and with the help of agents. So I need to have lubrication. Then this is this is not the material I'm really engineering. Yeah? This is not my raw material. This is just a helper, yeah? agent, helper. helper matter. Okay. This is going inside the process and the output of the process are products, hopefully. Yeah. Products, then there is waste. Waste for sure. Yeah. And there is also energy. comes out. And in between there's the process, like I said, different steps which will be followed. And the balance, the balance must be equal. The process must be balanced. So this means whatever goes inside must come out of the process. It's not that easy because energy usually is wasted in, in heat, but also heat is disappearing from the process somewhere. Yeah? And our automation uh, will try to control the process, to lead the process. This is also where the German word led technique comes from. Yeah? To lead the process, to pilot the process uh, in a manner that it works like it should be. Uh, a wishful way. Uh, Covering all those stuff, yeah? there is information. Yeah? Everywhere in this process, 
information. is generated or needed somehow. Yeah? So there is information management. This is a very integral part yeah, of process technology. And all those stuff together, yeah, the whole bunch of it, this is running in a so-called system. A system in the technical matter yeah, is a precisely defined area in which the process takes place. Yeah. There might be interfaces yeah, where it's defined. Yeah. That's a system. It's more a lot of words. I know, I know. Yeah. However, these are the words we are using. Yeah. And this is a process. Yeah. And now, we want to talk about how we can show, visualize the process, what it is doing. Okay, this is the goal, and this will be done in next video. Next new video, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> next video, we're going to talk about flow processes. Yeah, so continuous processes which somehow flowing. Yeah, Fließprozess in German. This will be next video. Yeah? Another type of process is piece process. Yeah? So one piece after the other, yeah? item, one item after the other. But next time we are going to talk about continuous process, yeah? what we can show, yeah? how we can show what the process looks like. For this time, thank you very much for listening and goodbye.